This video was brought to you by the WhatNot app. Download the free WhatNot app today and participate in live auctions from your smart device. Funko Pops, Silver Age and Golden Age comics. There's Pokemon cards and participate in live auctions on the WhatNot app. Today we're opening up a $250 The Nerdy Newt. Full title of it is the Holiday Collector's Mystery Box, 250 bucks. I bought a total of eight of these mystery boxes. We're gonna do one today. Before we jump into this box though, we're gonna do one appetizer to start with. What we're gonna do is just one mysterygrail.com Fungal Pop mystery box just to get the video going. These are only 15 bucks a piece. Every single one has a Fungal Pop that comes in a brand new Pop Shield Pop Protector. Pop Shields is what I use on all of my Fungal Pops. You wanna get yourself some Fungal Pop Pop Protectors? Check out 7boxpop.com, direct link down below, check them out. That's who I use for my Funko Pops. You'll get a brand new pop, you'll get a scratch off crack, you get bonus prizes, tokens, gift cards, t-shirts, pop armors, pop shields, completely free, and there's candy in here. The pop itself has no guaranteed value. It could be worth five bucks, it could be worth 500 bucks. No guaranteed value. Every Sunday at 3 p.m. at mrgirl.com sells around 1,750 boxes, so they, they do a lot of boxes. Every box always has Mega Grails. I've never hit a Mega Grail. Maybe today's the day. Let's see what I got. Mega Grail? No, not a Mega Grail. We got the Fruit Loops cereal box with arms and legs. This was one of the most unneeded pops that they did were all the cereal pops where they gave the cereal box arms and legs. It really serves no purpose. Of course, we got the candy. We got fruities in here, two fruities. Here we go, scratch off card. Let's do a scratch off card first. Then we'll do PPG value. Scratch off card, I want an additional 200 bonus tokens I can use on the mrgrail.com website. I've been saving those things up now for like, what, two years? I'm pushing 60,000 tokens now. And once I finally get like grail status, like mega grail status, and I'll, I'll cash them in for like a huge pop. This is worth $7. So the appetizer, I lost a little bit of money. Got some free candy though. But you're not here for the appetizer though, right? Right? I hope not. You want the main course? Let's do it. Nerdy Newt. $250 Holiday Collector's Funko Pop Mystery Box. Details. Four to six pops per box. Weight-wise, I'm guessing six pops in there. It says box values range between $200 to $700. So spending $250, you know right off the bat you could lose $50 a box. Or you can come out ahead almost three times your money back. So some people got to win, some people will have to lose. But it says, everything comes in special holiday packaging. Top boxes include pops like the Freddy Funko Scott Pilgrim, by itself is worth 570 bucks. The Vaulted Homer Simpson, the OG Homer, worth 470. And in Indiana Jones 2016 SDCC PBG of $410. Limited only 40 boxes. I bought eight in total. So I bought 20% of the entire run. Limited to two per household. For the first 24 hours. So the first two or the first 24 hours, I bought my two. After 24 hours was up, there were still like what six boxes left. So I have a total of eight of these boxes. We're gonna do one today. We have seven more. So I spent what two thousand dollars on these eight boxes. So this should be fun. Let's see what I get from all these eight boxes. It should be double box, right? They're usually double box. And it is double boxed. Box in the box. They said the special holiday packaging. And it looks like you actually don't get to choose your like like your box number or anything. But this was box number. I saw a number on there somewhere. There it is, box number 25. Ooh, let's see. Weight test. You can hear like a pop stack in there. You can, you can hear it. So there's at least a pop stack. So that's a good sign. Let's see what I got. You said, was it two to six pops? No, four to six pops per box. I'm guessing this one has six pops in because of the of, of the weight in the box. And yeah, right here, corner right here, we got a 
We have a heart stack. Okay, so there are uh, four in softball protectors, one no protector, and then one that is in a heart stack. Here you go. First one, no pop protector at all. The backs of the Wonder Woman. We've got the Amazon exclusive glow in the dark Wonder Woman from Black Lantern. I've never seen that one before. Came out in 2021. Glow in the dark pop. A lot of people out there love the glow in the dark pops. I've never seen that one. Okay. First one that is in a pop protector. The back says Cartoon Network. We've got Courage the Cowardly Dog. I don't think I ever watched this show. I don't think I did. This might have been after my childhood because I was born in 1980. So some of these cartoons that I see in these pops came out like in the 90s when I was like, you know, I was a teenager. And I wasn't watching cartoons as, as a teenager. 2021 pop. It is a year old. Okay. I've never heard of that one. Or I've heard of it. I've never seen, I should say. Okay, here we go. Next one. The back says Naruto. We've got... Okay, we got Kakashi Anbu. The AAA anime exclusive chase. Anime pops always sell really well. Naruto's used to sell like almost full PPG, but I'd say in the past six, six months to eight months, I'm not getting full PPG anymore for Naruto pops, it seems like. They've kind of like have cooled down a lot. And PPG, honestly, on a lot of these pops for Naruto, the PPG needs to be lowered on it. Personal opinion. Here we go. Next one, Pop Protector. Back says Star Wars. We have Darth Vader Funko Shop exclusive Star Wars. Is this from, looks like, this is from Empire Strikes Back, Darth Vader. From the back of it, we have Han Solo and Carbonite. This has to be the Empire version of Darth Vader. Okay. First four. Here we go. Sub Paw Protector again. The back says the Batman. We have Oswald Cobblepot Chase. I watched this one finally. I, I actually bought it on Voodoo. It was on sale for like 10 bucks. I bought it. This movie was freaking terrible. It was terrible. It was not good at all. What's his name? Robert Patterson, who played Batman. Terrible. He is not a good Batman. It, the movie was horrible. Like it, it really took me a week to finish it because because I sat out and watched like, like the first half an hour of it, and I was just like, I this is a terrible movie. The acting was awful. It was horrible. And then a few days later, I was like, let me watch a little bit more. I watched another 50, 20 minutes. I'm like, man, this is terrible. And then within a week or so, 10 days, I finished it, but I will never watch it again. That was a terrible movie. It was not good. And a lot of people ran and raved about how great it was, like in theaters. I watched it, and I freaking love Batman. It was, it was a terrible movie. It was not good. It wasn't actually, I'd say it was worse than the new Thor movie. And the new Thor movie was pretty bad. And I'd rather watch the Thor movie over the Bat, the the Batman with the Twilight guy as Batman. Anyway, rant over. Last pop. This is in a pop stack. Oh, it says Booberry. Okay. This is the newer Booberry 2018. It's not crazy expensive. It's like, it's, it's like what, 60 bucks? It's not crazy expensive. Actually, probably the best pop in here is probably that Naruto Chase in terms of value. Okay. Six pops. Nothing like earth shattering big. I probably got close to my money back. Maybe lost a little bit. But let's go ahead. Let's see PPG value. Let's see how I did. First pop, Wonder Woman Black Lantern coming in at 20 bucks. Pop number two, we got Darth Vader coming in now at $24. Pot number three, we have Oswald Cobblepot Chase. This one is coming in at $26. Pot number four, we have Courage the Cowardly Dog coming in at $33. Pot number five, we have Kakashi Anbu Chase coming in at $47. Last pop, Boo Berry. He's got value a little bit. Last time I saw him, he was worth like $60. Bucks, but he's now coming in at $70. So I did lose money. Total PPG I got back in this box was 220 bucks. I spent 250, got back 220, lost 30 bucks in this box. And even after I pay selling fees on these, I'll, I'll lose about 50 bucks total in this box when it's all said and done. So not the best box. Didn't I? I got over guaranteed value was 200, right? I think yeah, right it was 200. 
So I got over guaranteed value, but I still lost from what I actually spent in the box. But I got six Fantastic Pops. All these will be for sale in a future What Not Live auction. What Not is the number one marketplace to buy and sell all of your collectibles. There'll be a drug down below in the description box. Also be a QR code down here. Click on the QR code with your with your camera app. Download the completely free WhatNot app. If you use my link down below or my QR code, you'll even save 15 bucks in your very first purchase. So your first pop, you buy for 15 bucks, it's free. It's a win-win situation. So I'll see you in the future WhatNot live auction. I auction every weekend live on WhatNot. So I'll see you then. This video was brought to you by the WhatNot app. Download the free WhatNot app today and participate in live auctions from your smart device. You can buy Funko Pops auction style, Silver Age and Golden Age comics. There's Pokemon cards, pack breaks, and box breaks. You can have sports cards ripped for you live that you purchase. Download the WhatNot app today and participate in live auctions on the WhatNot app.